Hey, let's go ahead and talk about uh, proper placement in your vehicle. Um, I'm in a, a Jeep Cherokee, this is a 20. I'm about 6'4", 260, so I'm a bigger guy. I have my seat all the way back. I have a slight bend in my knees. I have large uh, arms and hands, so I wanna have a slight bend. And as you can tell, as I'm moving up, I'm moving slowly. You know, we're just in a drive-through, so I'm gonna go ahead and give you some information to help you become a good driver. You wanna see the rear of the vehicle. Um, a lot of beginning drivers overturn. And if you overturn, you're gonna go over the curb. Okay, you wanna turn smoothly, hand over hand into the turn, and you wanna turn out smoothly, hand over hand out, right? That is important. Uh, next, you need to know where your instrument panel is. Obviously, we have our tachometer to the left. We have our speedometer to the right. It's also a digital speedometer. We have about 55 miles of uh, you know, range left for fuel. Our temperature gauge is in the middle, which is right here. Our fuel gauge is to the right. Uh, this car does have climate control. These are our four-way flashers. This car, I believe, I'm gonna go ahead and move up. And you see how I'm turning the wheel, not overturning, not underturning, right? And you wear out going through a drive-through. This car does have climate control. When you're taking your road test, they're gonna ask you some basic things about your vehicle. Your windshield cannot be cracked. You need to have proper insurance in the car, right? You need to have registration. You need to at least have a quarter to half of tank of fuel. Your test will take anywhere from about 45 minutes uh, to 50 minutes. Um, you wanna make sure your headlights, taillights work. These things are important. You wanna be comfortable with the car that you have. Most cars have daytime running lights. I'm moving up slowly and my foot is on the brake. You wanna keep your foot on the brake. A lot of beginning drivers drive with the wrong foot. This is an automatic, we don't have a clutch. This is the dead pedal. I'm looking down to it. This is, I wear SAS 14, so excuse my big feet. This is the dead pedal. You have your brake in the middle and you have your gas pedal to the right. They all are computer controlled. Okay, you wanna have your car fairly clean. I'm showing you real examples because the road tester will come in and look at your vehicle, check it. You wanna make sure your vehicle's vacuumed. It's looking clean, smelling fresh. You know, we're not too bad back here, right? Um, so those things are important. You're gonna go on a route, uh, take it through neighborhoods, uh, residential, you're gonna be merging on expressway. So these things are important. So I'm just trying to give you some information to help prepare. You should already be working on your parallel park maneuvers, angle park, stall park, uh, having good speed control. You always want to turn into the nearest lane. I hope this brought you value. And if it did, let me know. And I will be giving you some other content very soon. Thank you. I appreciate you.